Well, let's just say the other day I kind of made a big mistake and that is I showed you guys all of our diamond mule deer that we had But unfortunately, I totally forgot about an entire trophy lodge full of mule deer In fact, there was five other mule deer that I never showed you guys So what I did was I went through every single one of my trophy lodges Gathered all of our mule deer and combined them into one main trophy lodge here so now I have every single diamond OG and diamond Shurak Muley all in this one trophy lodge. And we're going to go through today and we're going to take a look at every single one of them. Starting with this one. This one's my all time favorite. It's got the most character on it. It's super, super wide and just an incredible Muley. We took him down with the Hawk Edge bow as well. I do believe Ramek Tube has this exact same rack. Well, at least the one side, the non-typical looking rack. I think the other side, his rack might have been a little bit different. I'm pretty sure his rack was actually um, this buck over here, which is the smaller diamond rack that came out in the beginning. I'm pretty sure one of his side uh, has that rack on it. But anyways, <laughs> that right there is definitely one of our favorite, or definitely one of my favorite all-time diamond muley racks right there. Just super, super wide. Tons of stickers on them. I think that was like a overall spread of like 52 inches, which is absolutely unbelievable. But then over here, we have an entire wall full of diamond muleys, including this 515 OG diamond muley. Here we got a 327 big rack, true rack diamond muley. Uh, non-typical 340 true rack diamond muley. This is the small rack 318 diamond muley true rack and another diamond non-typical true rack muley 335 scoring diamond. So this entire hall is full of diamond muleys. Then we'll come back over here and take a look at this wall. All right, here we have a 520 OG Diamond Muley. I believe we took him down with the recurve bow, and we also had a pretty epic moment where we took him down out of a tree stand, and I'm pretty sure this is the exact same buck that we took down, and the video was called, This is what it takes to get a monster true rack diamond muley. Except it's not a true rack diamond, you moron. Anyways, <laughs> this is not... <laughs> this is not a true rack. This is what it takes to get a monster diamond muley. That's what I was trying to say. But anyways, next we have a huge true rack diamond muley here. A 331 monster diamond true rack muley. And we actually snuck up on him and took him down with the Hawkage bow as well. But then this here is almost the exact same buck, which reminds me of the muley that we messed up on uh, yesterday, or no, two days ago. Well, we didn't technically mess it up. It's just that the game crashed and we lost him and we never got a chance to see him again. But anyways, this here scored 332. And then this here is another one of the the uh, small rack diamond muleys scored 318. And then over here, we have another OG diamond muley 515 score. I think we took him down with the Hawkage bow on a multiplayer server, to be honest. But then over here, last but not least, is the big rack diamond muley. And with this guy here, we took down with Lady Legend. I remember I was sneaking up on him through the grass and she was watching from afar and next thing you know I was like okay he's coming out it's now or never we gotta take the shot drew back and let one fly and smoked him but overall now you can see just how many mule deer we have accomplished to get in Call of the Wild since the beginning and not only that there's probably two or three more OG diamond muleys that I don't have here that we got before the trophy lot just came out oh no the trophy lodges actually were out, but what happened was I lost my entire trophy lodge and I lost all of my save files during that time. So I lost like three or four um, big rack. Actually, one of them was a 1000 diamond muley, a 1000 OG diamond muley. I forgot about that one. That's the one that we made that video on. But anyways, overall right now we have a total of 12 diamond muleys in one trophy lodge. All right, so I actually discovered something that I can't believe I forgot, but this guy right in front of us here is a melanistic giant 280 scoring mule deer that we got, and I had to find him and put him here. So what I did is I replaced the buck that was here from before, and I put this giant 280.3 melanistic super rare mule deer buck right here and he looks absolutely unbelievable but 
what I did is I moved the other buck over to here. But then I also realized I found two more mule deer that uh, were in different trophy lodges as well. So that will put us at 14 diamond mule deer. 14. So here's one of them right here. In fact, this guy here I got on my birthday, June 4th of 2021. But I remember this buck here. We almost messed him up. I took a shot as he was trotting at 330 yards and it was with the, I think like the M1 back then. And um, I hit him way far back, but luckily it didn't take him down and we only got a flesh hit. So then I tracked him down and ended up taking the shot and we got a nice vital hit the second shot. But this was the messed up looking non-typical mule deer, which looked super ugly before, but since they corrected it, now it looks really, really cool. So I'm so glad that we actually do have him here. And he actually scores 338.6, which is a giant muley buck. Definitely a giant buck. But then I found another non-typical muley that I put over here as well. Check this out. Right here, this buck right here, he scored 340 a diamond true rack. That's the ugly rack as well, but it got fixed. So there was two ugly racks, right? This one and the one I just showed you. But anyways, with these two other bucks here, that's going to put us at 14 diamond muleys. And all of a sudden I was actually looking back in my videos and that's when I saw this and I'm like, wait a second, where is this deer? And it took me so long to figure out where it was. And that's because I had it in a different lodge way back in this room over here by this bighorn sheep. And then I realized, oh wow, I gotta put him out in the front. That's a pretty sweet looking animal. And sure enough, here he is right here, man. Definitely one of our coolest and rarest mule deer in Call of the Wild here by far. But yeah, on that note there, that's gonna be it for this video. Now you guys can see why I wasn't really that much upset about losing that monster diamond muley because we have 14 of them already including this incredible melanistic rare muley down too but anyways that's gonna be it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed it thanks so much for watching and i hope you guys enjoyed your awesome weekend you can see his massive rack right there so there's two bucks here there's two really good bucks here one's an absolute giant and one is a pretty good buck, like uh, probably 200. Maybe there's three different bucks here, guys. I honestly don't even know which one to take. <laughs> Two stud bucks. I mean, just phenomenal looking bucks. Look at that. I honestly don't even know which one we're going to take. They're both just super, super impressive. Come on. Come on. So, I think we're probably gonna take the second one. No freaking way, that's a melanistic. God. Holy, that is one phenomenal, incredible, super rare, melanistic, giant mule deer. And um, this is the one that I really wanted to get. So we're gonna smoke him too. Are you absolutely kidding me right now? Where did this thing come from? I, uh, I'm just totally speechless. This is one of the coolest rares by far that I've ever gotten on Parque Fernando. I mean, I can't say that this is probably even possible to happen, you know, when I'm hunting mule deer in real life, but I never even spotted this thing. I have no clue how big it is or anything. I don't know anything about this. A 280 gold melanistic.